analysts predict under what conditions Ukrainian counteroffensive will be successful. American analysts have named three options for the development of the Ukrainian counteroffensive, the most successful of which are steady pressure, interdiction campaign, and the creation of gaps in Russian defense lines. This was said in an article by Karolina Hurd and Katerina Stepanenko, analysts at the Institute for the Study of War, together with Frederick Kagan, an expert at the American Enterprise Institute for Time magazine. The article says that the situation in Ukraine remains favorable for Kyiv despite the limited progress made in the counteroffensive. American analysts pointed out the options for the development of the Defense Forces counteroffensive under which it will be successful. First, the current Ukrainian mechanized breakthrough could be successful and the Ukrainians could exploit it deeply enough to break part or all of the Russian defense lines. Second, Russian troops already suffering from serious morale and other systemic problems could break under pressure and begin a controlled or uncontrolled withdrawal. Third, steady pressure and interdiction campaign supported by a large-scale effort such as the one currently underway could create gaps in Russian defense lines that Ukrainian forces could exploit first at the local level and then for deeper invasion. The experts consider the first and second options possible but relatively unlikely. The third is the most likely path to Ukraine's success. It will be slower and more gradual than the other two and slower than Western supporters of Ukraine want and expect.